You've likely heard myself and many other tech creators talk about a monitor's refresh rate. If you're not too clear on what that is or what it means or why a higher one is better, this video should help you out. Let's start off with a definition. A refresh rate, normally measured in hertz, as in the number of times the thing happens per second, is essentially just the number of different frames that get displayed on the screen in a given amount of time, as in one second. Most monitors operate at 60 hertz. This means 60 frames are displayed on the screen per second. Now, there are a lot of other issues that can occur, with, you know, things like duplicated frames or frames only getting half drawn, but that's more of a topic for another Tech Explain video, so if you're interested in hearing about that, let me know in the comments down below. Otherwise, the, you know, when everything is working fine, the display will be updating every 16.7 milliseconds, drawing a new frame on the screen. And that may take a certain uh, you know, given amount of time, but again, that's another topic for a different video. Uh, so assuming everything is working, uh, you will have 60 frames displayed on screen every second. Now, there are some displays that offer different refresh rates. Most gaming monitors, or at least you know, higher end ones anyway, offer high refresh rate options, and that's generally, at least at the time of filming anyway, 144 hertz. That means 144 frames are drawn per second, and the reason that that's better for gaming is that you get a smoother, more, uh, I guess, fluid uh, look at what's going on on screen, and it can also be a slight competitive advantage as it gives you an extra frame or two to be able to, say, see an enemy coming around a corner in your game, rather than with the 60 hertz screen where you have to just wait for the screen to update and then you'll be able to see your enemy or whatever else. The highest commercially available refresh rate right now is actually 240 hertz. Uh, this is for definitely the more professional gamer side of things with incredibly fast reaction times, but if you're a normie like the rest of us, then 144Hz is all you need for gaming. No matter the refresh rate though, every display, at least currently anyway, updates the screen multiple times per second with new images. The higher that is, or the higher the refresh rate is, the smoother and more responsive your experience will be. This video has been part of the Tech Explained series. If you'd like to see anything else covered in this series, make sure you leave it in a comment down below, and if you want to check out the rest the series and take a look at the playlist over there. Also make sure you subscribe for new videos if you want to learn more about the tech world and of course if you want to support this channel and keep me making these videos on a Monday, Wednesday and Friday basis with live tech chats every Thursday night then take a look at the links in the description down below. There's Amazon and Overclock UK affiliate links which don't cost you anything to use but massively help me out. You can support me directly on Patreon and get some cool rewards for doing so or check out the rest of the links for merch for private internet access which is a great and cheap VPN and Humble Bundle for cheap games that support charities too. Otherwise, thanks for watching. If you have any questions, leave those in the comments down below, and we'll see you all in the next video.